Hey, guy. What? Did you just teleport away from me? What the crap? Hey guys, how's it going? It's me, of course, Dolan Meister, we are back, we are back with some more All of the Mods 3 Journey Through the Lost Cities. Oh yeah! Hope you guys are ready and excited for today's episode, because we got some stuff to do, some things to work on, some projects to fiddle with, and I am pretty excited about that. Yeah! So the one thing we've been working on the most, especially a lot recently, is getting more resources. So one thing I did, by the way, between episodes, is I upgraded my storage system to have two 64Ks. Everything that was in the 4Ks that I had, which are almost full, by the way, fit into one 64K storage. Look at that. Look at that. Crazy. This guy, this little guy here, has got 1K stuck in it. I don't know if that's just like a bug or what, and I can't do anything with it. I can't clear it. I don't think I can. Yeah, there's no way. And there's nothing in here. Like, if I put this in and remove both these guys... You'll see the crafting grid is empty. So I don't know what to do about that. So for now, it's just going to be stuck in here filled with stuff. So another thing that I did, another thing that I worked on is I went and I made another industrial grinder because I remember how I made the second electrolyzer. And I actually was planning on doing this anyways eventually, but because I already made the second electrolyzer, I went ahead and made another industrial grinder because if you put water in here, you can process certain things. So there's certain things that'll process through with mercury, certain things that I want that'll process through with mercury, but not everything needs to be processed with mercury. This is going to be a very occasional kind of thing. So most of the other stuff I want with water and with the water, we get a lot. I mean, look at this, look at all this gold that I got. And it's nice because I get a lot of other extra junk out of this, which is what makes this worth it. And the thing is with this, I always get extra like I love these other ones and don't get me wrong I, I really do love like the pulverizer and things like that but the problem with the pulverizer is it is a chance to get something else not a confirmed gonna get something else with this guy with the industrial pulverizer I'm sorry industrial grinder I will always get a second little extra something with it every single time without fail. Granted, it's a small pile, but you know what? That small pile of copper, that entire stack right here gives me 16 extra copper. I mean, that's fantastic. It's fantastic. So that is why we're doing that. That is why we're running it this way. And you know what? I am totally a-okay with that. That's good. That's good, right? All right. So what I'd like to do today is we'd like to go back over here. Oh, and, and I don't remember if I did it on camera or not, but I went ahead and set this guy up in the uh, the digital miner in the, as you can see here, in the, in the end as well. Because I'm trying to get dimensional shards, and I thought dimensional shards were available because if you look up dimensional shards, dimensional, these guys, you can see that there is a regular one, which I'm pretty sure is only available in RF tools dimensions. Then there's a nether one and a end one. And I thought those were available in the nether and the end. They used to be. So he must have changed something in the configs or something that they no longer are. I don't know. So that just means we're going to have to eventually do some age hopping, which is fine. I do plan to uh, not age. <laughs> It's the wrong term. That's that's miscraft. Uh, we we'll do some world hopping and we'll we'll do some some quantum leap into other dimensions. Also, does it feel like my brightness? My brightness feels weird. Like it feels like it's kind of set to moody, which is interesting. Shadows. Huh. Whatever. So what I'd like to do today, though, things that need to be done is let's grab some ender pearls. How many do I have? I have a few, and that'll be fine. I just need like two. For now and that should do me just fine let's put our yet pack back on and we're going to go ahead and dial the end island once and head over here so that we can pop our head through one of the uh the, the portals just like an enderman. let's go ahead and turn this guy on yeah you'll be okay mr enderman that's why i'm just gonna fly over top of you so you don't try to mess with me so we need to go to this guy, and we need to go to one of the end islands, because what I'd like to find... Actually, I'm curious. Curious about my glider. Did you really? He did. 
Okay, so the glider doesn't actually put you into a one by one space. I didn't think so, but you know what? It was worth a shot. The gateway. Nice. Nice. Uh, Jetpack will just set to regular. So, what I'd like to find out here is a one of the one of the end cities because the end cities have a couple of things that we're going to be looking for today. One of them being end rods because we need end rods for doing a bunch of different things. Also, I just kind of wanted to see what we had out here, what it kind of looked like, see if I could find some dimensional shards. <laughs> Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure the dimensional shards are no longer spawning in non-dimensions made by RF tools, which is totally fine as long as I understand that. I just was hoping that I didn't have to start using that kind of power right now, but if I have to, then I have to, and then we'll just deal with it, right? Right. All right, so I'm going to fly around for a minute. I'm going to see if I can find an end city, and it'll probably be like as soon as I hit stop recording, I'm probably going to just fly right up on one, most likely, but... It may be, uh, maybe longer. What is that? What is that? Oh, it's one of the, it's one of the teleport points. Oh, that's cool. So yeah, this is, uh, if you didn't know, they added in these to, for return home. So that way, in case you are out here, so there's another one right over there. Huh. They're more frequent than I thought. So this will take you back to the portal, which is pretty dang cool. Anyways, like I said, give me a second and we'll be right back. See, I told you it wouldn't be long. I literally just said we'll be right back like a second ago. Now, this is one of the crappy ones. It doesn't have the uh, the boat, which sucks, which means there won't be an elytra. But we uh, at least still have some good stuff here. So we should be able to come in. And one of the things we want to grab, there's a couple things I want to grab while I'm here. And there's, so that's a part of the reason I was really hoping to find one that had the, the uh, what's it called? Um, one of the boats because I really wanted to get the elytra because I wanted to see what the the upgraded oh cool this is an achievement the upgraded uh, wings look like or the the upgraded glider because I was I was curious about that hey guy what? did you just teleport away from me what the crap oh because he's taking damage from my oh look at that I love the meteors it's still one of the cool things one of the things I do want to grab while we're here though is these. For sure, which is part of the reason why I came out here. I know we can make these, and we do actually happen to have an infinite supply of blaze rods now, so we no longer need to. We no longer need to uh, worry about that. Uh, so glad I had flight, because if I didn't, this would really suck. Come on. Oh, I hate you so much. You know what? I have a bow. I should probably be using my bow. Come on. Oh, you died too? Did you happen to drop a shulker? Oh, we got one. Oh. Blah, blah, blah. I love these guys. These are my favorite mobs in vanilla Minecraft, by the way. Like, they... I love the noises they make. I just, I just love them. They're fantastic. Where are you? There you are. Hey, guy. Did you teleport away? You jerk. Yeah, no, I, I, I absolutely love the Shulkers so much. They are my absolute favorite in this game. <sighs> These jerks suck so bad. I need a different sword. I think this sword is... Let me grab my bronze sword out. Which does have sharpness 4 on it. That's right. But I don't have looting on it, which sucks. But that's fine. We'll make do with what we got. Ugh. Oh, this is even worse than vanilla, so I'm really glad to have this in modded, because in vanilla, it's just, it's awful. Oh, yeah. And those things will uh, track you forever. Where are you? There you are. Did you drop another shulker? No. Hmm. I know there's things that do pretty much what shulker cases do in modded, but I wanted to mess around with Iron Chest's version of the shulker box, because they have... Uh, they have uh, their own iron chest version now, which is pretty cool if you ask me. So that's part of the reason why I wanted to grab one. So, yeah, that's good. But we have the end rods, which is also really good because that's something we need. No, you suck so much. So much. All right, so I'm going to see if I can get myself another shulker case. And then I'm going to find another end city so I can get the elytra wings. 
and uh, and deal with that. So we'll be back, guys, in in a second. So there's the one we were just at, and here's another one with the boat, which is what I wanted. So let's get into the boat real quick. This is cool. It's I, I love these end cities. I'm really glad they added this to vanilla. Like, this has got to be one of my favorite things that they've added in vanilla. All right, let's get down in here. There should be a shulker. Thank you. And the wings. And what do we have in here? Anything useful? Uh, fire aspect, soul stealer, sharpness four. Mm. Ooh, a proven grafter. Nice. Potion of levitation. Yeah, no. Ender drone. We'll take that. We'll take that. Corrupted chorus. That's actually pretty cool. Uh, like it's nothing like crazy good, but it's just kind of a cool little, little thing. Steadfast drone. We'll take the drones in case we do decide to go crazy and you know get into bees. So this should allow me to make. I need two of them. Are you serious? The advanced hang glider. So I don't know what that does differently than the normal hang glider, but I kind of want to make it. So we're going to... I'm going to see if I can buy one more boat, I guess, so that I can make it. No! Ugh. Aha! I got another shulker casing out of that. And while we're here, let's grab the dragon head. Because it's a stinking dragon head. Did I get it? I did. Nice. All right, let's. Uh, I'm gonna find one more, hopefully just as fast, and grab one more elytra wing, and uh, we'll be uh, we'll be right back. And there we go. Last one. Ooh, a barroja. What do we got for boots? Unbreaking three, launch three, protection four. What's launch three? Huh. Curious. Cover me with diamonds. What? Oh, I guess I haven't made diamond armor yet. Cool. So we got all three. This is one of the big end cities here, which is Q. Which is Q. So I guess let's head home. Grab a couple more of these end rods. Actually, what I keep forgetting to grab is... Whoa. Whoa. Activate. <laughs> it wasn't activating. I had a mini heart attack there. Oy. Yeah, let's... Uh... <laughs> Let's grab some of these guys because we need some of the seeds so we can plant our own chorus fruits. We'll grab a couple more just while we're here. And it's, uh, yeah. Yeah. Good. Okay. That should be adequate, I think. Just bust this up and get some of the chorus fruit. And then we can head back home right after I look at this Enderman. Good job. All right, let's head back. Teleport. While we're teleporting, we'll eat. Oh, cool. Did we actually manage to eat? We did. Good. All right, so what I'd like to make, what I'd like to do is go ahead and take a look at the quantum core. Yeah, this guy. So we have another star from the last episode, which we can now do that with. And we also now have, we should have enough to make the picks we need for this, I would imagine. I have a lot of diamonds. A lot of diamonds. <laughs> but we should be able to do this now without any issues. So we need five of these. No, we need six of these. What am I thinking? Six. There we go. And there is that. So there's that, which is Q. Uh, now, let's go ahead and pull up Iron Chest as well, just for fun. And we will see that we have, like I was saying, the Iron Shulker Chest which just needs regular shulker chest. So we need to do that. So I should have, do I have any? I don't think I have any in here. This is just more of a morbid curiosity. Because like I said, we don't really need the shulker chest because we can, uh, we can use normal, or not normal stuff, but we can, we can, there's other mods that do similar stuff. Let's put a lot of this junk away. Want to plant that. So yeah, this corrupted chorus fruit, if you've not seen this before, this is from Cyclic. If you eat it, you can pass through blocks, which is super cool if you ask me. Oh yeah, and then I forgot it gives you nasty stuff afterwards. We got two dragon heads. Uh, can I repair you? Is there, are you? Are you repairable? I don't know. Let's see if we can make... 
Oh, why did I do that? Well, I might need to do that anyways. So I guess we'll find out in a second. We'll do that and that. Let's just, we'll make two. Why not? We're here. Let's see if it'll work with these and the Elytra. Elytra. My guess is it's not going to work because this thing is broken. Yeah, so we'll need to make one more. Those don't stack. We're doing we're doing a couple of things here. So bear with me, guys. This is this is experiment day, right? All right. So there's our new one, and then we can do this, 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 and this. Let's put that in there. So this gives us the advanced hang glider, huh? So what do you do? That's different than the normal hang glider. It is nighttime. Let's sleep real quick. And let's find out what we can do with this thing. Because that will be kind of cool to figure out. If this thing is really baller, then sweet. Because, I mean, I don't need anything crazy. But, eh, it's nice to have a good one. Ooh. Oh, it doesn't have durability. Is that the difference? Oh, no, it does. It's just, there it goes. It's a lot faster. Oh, my goodness. Oh, this is nice. Oh, what's that? Broken textures. What? What do we have for broken textures here? Bookshelves. That's odd. What? Are my bookshelves broken? I think mine are broken. Wow, that actually was really fast. Whoa. Oh, yeah. What the crap? That's weird. It must be my, uh, my resource pack being derpy. Okay, so that is uh, that is exactly what I was hoping it would actually be, is that it would be a lot faster, and it is. So that is cool. Hang glider, you did me well for a long time, but now you're going to go away, and I'm never going to use you again. We're going to put that in there next to my other backup hang glider. So it's got a lot more durability. Uh, it's a lot faster, which is neat, and things like that. So that is really cool. So the shulker boxes now. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and grab some iron, and let's go ahead and try this. Yeah, so that is how that works. Now, can I die you still? I don't think so. So, do I have any? No, I don't. I should have some cactus greens in here, though. So, I think... I'm, I actually don't know how to die these. Because I've not done that before. I'm hoping it's just like this. It is. Okay. Can I do that with you? Oh, I can. Excellent. Alright, so let's take a look at these two. Let's place that down, place that down. So this is the old color, this is the new color. I actually like the new color. So the normal uh, normal one looks like this. Expanded one is just a double chest. Oh, that is awesome. And we can break it. Now, what about upgrading this to a gold chest? Slime, yeah. So we can do that, and this should be the same size as a regular gold chest, right? Yeah, and then we can upgrade this to a diamond chest next, which will be really cool. And we can do that right here. Like that, like that. Lime diamond chest. Yeah. So here's my real question. If I put this in here, so if, as you know, if you put something in these and break them, you, it keeps their inventory, right? So what happens if I upgrade it to the obsidian one? So there's one brick, one brick. What? What? That is amazing. Okay. Okay, I'm sold. These are cool. This is actually really useful now that it's a large chest. So I can do quite a bit with that, which means I can... It's going to be useful for doing stuff like this because I don't need to take anything with me to try to break it. So it'll be good for when I'm doing any kind of mining with the digital miner. So I'm actually totally sold on this. Like, this is going to go in my bag along with my digital miner, which is in my bag as well. So that and that will be in here together, which is really cool. I'm very tickled about that. So the next thing, though, that I want to do to wrap up this episode is we're going to go and get quantum. And I wanted to do it. I think I'm going to do it in the basement. So let's go back on downstairs. And let's see how we're going to do for our power drain. I'm thinking, I'm thinking right here will be perfect. Can I place you? I can't. You know, I'm okay with this, but at the same point, it's still kind of annoying. 
can I place you down now? I can't. So I actually have to go underneath and place it. Boop. Now, does this take grid power? I don't think it does. So my generator just kicked off. All right. So if you've not seen this before, this is a pretty cool... Oh, there's a biomarker. That's new. I haven't checked these out yet. So you can actually select which biomes you want to quarry, which is totally cool. Ocean biome, plains, extreme hills. That is actually... How do you get these? Oh. Okay, that just gives you a biome marker. But then what do I do with you? I'm guessing you right-click it on the biome? I don't know. I, those, are, those are fairly new, so I haven't had a chance to check them out yet. Let's grab our power cube. Let's grab our new shulker box and we'll place that down. And we'll place this down next to it because we can. And we should see that this thing is not getting any orders because it's there we go yeah so that was one of my concerns so well, we are getting a bunch of garbage so here's the next question how fast are we draining power pretty fast which is to be expected right now because we're just running off of two generators but this should start grabbing a lot of stuff so one thing we can do is we can turn this thing off for right now and let our power kind of resume but we can come on up to the fifth floor and we can go ahead and make ourselves a filter to get rid of all the stuff we don't need so filter i don't know why i just typed in filter in there filter this guy make one excellent oh yeah give me this piece of string so uh for that one commenter who said to to do this you know, I, I had originally planned on doing this, so it, it's not like it wasn't something I had planned, but there you go. I put some string there. See? String. Um, all right, let's head back down to the basement real quick, and let's take a look at the garbage that we got. So we got ourselves some cobble, which we don't need, some dirt, and some more limestone. And that's about it for right this second, but we can go ahead and add these things to the list. And then turn that on, turn this guy back on. We should start seeing, hopefully... Oh, no, 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 that was backwards. I want a blacklist. There we go. So now we shouldn't be seeing any of our cobble. We are going to see marble, though, so I'll need to keep adding stuff to the list, obviously, as it progresses through the biomes. So we can add you, because we don't need a ton of that. That'll be good. We can also add gravel. I don't have gravel on here yet. So let's do that. Gravel. Got limestone, dirt, cobble. We'll take the flint. We can use the flint, so that's not a big deal. But this will start getting us crap tons of ore. As you can see, it's mining really, really fast. And we'll also drain the living crap out of our power system. So that is something we're going to need to, to get on, like, ASAP. So I will figure out how I want to do that. Do we have... Do we have extreme reactors? We don't. But we have a lightning rod from Tech Reborn. <clears throat> Advanced machine casing needs chrome. Only needs that. Energy flow circuits needs iridium plates. Okay, this isn't <clears throat> this isn't that bad actually. I might be able to do this sooner than you might think. Iridium's not an issue at all. We have a lot of iridium, and we can do that easily. Chrome is made from ruby dust, which we have a lot of rubies from the miner in the mining dimension. So if we go to the mining dimension, uh, there is a zombie in the mining dimension. Okay. Uh, we have... Okay, we don't have a crap ton. we got three stacks here and half a stack here. So we have a bunch of rubies, and we can run the miner a bit as well. Was uh, Red Garnet the other one? What's the... Uh, that's not what I wanted. I wanted you. Chrome... You light dust, which is from yellow garnet dust. Oh, it's... 
We don't have any yellow garnets. I don't know where you'd get yellow garnets. We have red garnets, but no yellow garnets. So, oh, we do have extreme reactors. I thought so. I just need to remember how to look things up. Okay. So we do have extreme reactors, which we could mess around with as well. Uh, which is really actually useful because we can use Eulorium to make Mox Fuel. So we might do that because that would be really cool. But we can make the Mox Fuel, which is super duper nice. Uranium 235, huh? Okay. So that'll be something, that'll be kind of a project to work on a bit. So I might end up setting up a little bit of stuff with the Eulorium. Oh, I don't think I ever showed you the pump jacks. Here are the pump jacks, by the way. Pump jack number one, pump jack number two. Just ran around and I found uh, oil, de oil deposits in the mining dimension. And set up the, the miner. So yeah, cool. That gives us some stuff to work on. We got some stuff going, which is really cool. We got some power flowing, which is also really cool. We got another zombie pigman. Where did you come from, dude? <coughs> Oh wow, he just dropped like all of his armor, which is completely broken and garbage. So thank you for that, I guess. I don't know where that guy came from, but that's fine. I think that other one just went through the portal again. Fantastical. Nope, nope, he's still over here as we lag. Sorry about that. Cool. Um. Oh, it's I left it running. Oops. That's the other marble. Did I leave you running? I did leave you running. Am I out of power? I am out of power. Is my are my generators not running? So the only... Oh, I am out of fuel. What? What? How the heck am I out of fuel? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's insane. There's no way I'm out of fuel. Okay. Well, I'll have to figure that out. That's a bit of a crisis mode right now, to be honest. Yeah, I clicked that by accident with, uh, with lapis in my hand. Ah, oh, it's nighttime. Crap, I gotta figure out why I'm not getting any more fuel. What's going on? What's going on? Because that means I'm out of power if I'm out of fuel. I mean, granted, yes, we have the passive power that works as well, but it's like, it's not great, to be honest. I mean, it works, but let's just, let's just go and figure out pump jack's not running. Well, it kind of is running. That might be part of the issue. We are, is, are you running? Yeah, it's running. So, what's up, machines? Why you no do the thing? I think we're just getting fuel too slow now. Uh, that's almost full. Can I put gasoline in a diesel? Gasoline in a diesel? I don't actually know. I mean, technically, no. All right, so that is still running. I'm guessing this is going to slowly build up. I don't know why I ran out of fuel because that's been running pretty stable unless this is out of fuel, which is possible, I suppose, but it should take almost like 33 days to run. So I'll figure it out off camera. We'll be back next time. I need to figure out why my textures are all broken because those were not broken previously. Uh, I'll, uh, I'll, I'll derp around with that and see what I can figure out. So anyways, guys, I think that does it for today. I really do appreciate you watching as always. And, uh, we'll be back next time to do some more cool stuff in the All the Mods series that uh, I'm pretty, pretty stoked about. Yeah, you know, I'm stoked, which means I hope you guys are stoked. Can I hit the, no, can it? Now the real question is, did I hit the right floor? I did not. Okay, a little up. Nice. Nice. First time. Oh yeah. <laughs> Alright guys, we'll be back next time. Thanks for watching as always. If you enjoyed this episode, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. Leave me a like. I really do appreciate it. And if you're new to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button so you can get all the delicious Dolan Meister. Delicious. Meister in your subscription feed. Oh, yeah. So until next time, I'm of course Dolmeister, and we'll see you guys. Later. Bye.